Hello everyone, welcome to part 12 of my Cliff View project. Okay, so I've uh, changed the mods I'm using a bit. I went for a mod that uh, <clears throat> is supposed to stop traffic from despawning if it's stuck in <clears throat> if it's stuck in a jam. Um, that should reveal if I've got some real traffic jams here that aren't quite triggering. So I expect it will, it will take a little while to fully uh, filter through and become apparent if I actually have a traffic jam. Although it doesn't look like I do. Which is actually quite a good thing. At some point I should probably finish filling in this area here with pathways, but uh, I'm going to leave that alone for now. I need to decide just where I'm going to develop from here. See, I filled things in here. Oh, right. I don't actually need that stupid loop here. So, what I'm going to start off with is getting rid of it. Since the trains can just as easily turn around at the station, I don't actually need a loop here. Right. That also means I can straighten this out. Okay. So I'll do that. What I'm going to do actually is elevated out of here. Okay, so that means I'm going to want to curve things. That's probably not going to be the final alignment back here, but it does give me ground clearance for development around here. 
Now, if I start this back up again, Okay. Now I'll take another boo to see if I have traffic jams accumulating. And it looks like I don't. So it would seem I've got my uh, city running fairly well for the moment. Okay, uh, that seems like a reasonable situation. Um, I don't have any squares available for purchase at the moment. When's my next milestone? 60,000. Okay, so I need to clearly uh, start developing some more Um, well, residential, I guess. But the question is, where? Over here, I think. Maybe. No. No, I'm going to... I could just start developing a subdivision or so up here. But... I don't think so. I think I'll... I think I'll put a residential area in here. Okay. Now that's going to mean I need to some roads in here. Okay. Uh... Okay, so that will continue along the coastline. Uh, okay, good. This will continue along the highway. Right, good. And I'll have a couple of crossroads here. No, that's a little too close together. There we go. And one more will fit. Good. Okay, and just due to the lay of the land, this wedge shape seems to be the uh, most effective here. to uh, slalom that one under. Uh, okay. Okay, so that'll give me a second access into there. Um, now, I need that space already occupied, really. 
Okay. Well, there's ways around that. Okay. Okay. You know, I need a new word other than okay. But okay, that gets me uh, a decent uh, setup there. Uh, I need a park or two in here. Okay, that's that. And I'm going to need some sort of education thingy here. Um, and I think maybe another education thingy. Okay. Uh, now. let the uh, rich types have their coastal views I suppose I could use a blanket paint thing here but This will also work. Now on the downside, there'd be a bit of noise here, but on the upside, there isn't a lot of traffic. So it shouldn't be a big problem. Now, I think I'm going to put some Okay, I see for freight I'm going to need a freight link into there, so... Yeah. Okay, can I fit an elevation on this? Apparently not. Okay. Now, really. Okay.
Okay, so that gives me that. Now, I need to go up and over that to avoid traffic bottlenecks. Okay. Okay, so that gives me a freight link that I can work with. Okay. So I'm going to have to come along. and dump a train station over there. Okay. That means I'm going to need to elevate this. I'm keeping the uh, freight and uh, passenger rails separated here, um, and that's to avoid train congestion. nice if you could just plop these on top of the existing rail but you can't okay so We'll pretend this is the right place for the road. Now, height too high. Slope too steep. Let's try it there. No. So this here is why placing these things is a pain. Uh, okay. I might need to dig out the terraforming to make it work. Uh, okay. Let's try like so. Uh, nope. Okay. Well, 
guess I'll play with the terraforming. What's this do? Oh, that digs. Well, that reveals the blockiness of the map. Okay. Okay, that definitely explains the steep thing. Okay. Okay, that should give me a flat enough spot, I think. Yeah, that gives me a flat spot. Okay. Now, I should be able to go ahead and make a train uh, station. Yes. Good. Right, I need to link the rail up. Okay. Okay, so that's going to want to curve. Not quite like that. Right. Maybe not so much like that. Uh, yeah. Right, okay, yeah, I think that's kind of how I want to do that. There we go. Yeah, that doesn't look quite so bad now. Okay. Obviously, I need to connect the road up here. Uh, okay.
right. And I need one going the other way. Too steep. Right. This needs to go the other way. I probably got that going the wrong way. But, uh, need to get some services in here. Wee. Okay. And. Now, set up for some should replace my pathway there. Yeah, like that. Okay, the odd walk through there can't be go amiss. Okay. some uh, commercial development over here since it seems like that would be a useful thing to have since you know there's commercial demand okay speed that up I may just go ahead and create myself a traffic problem by doing this. One of the things that uh, um, I've read that you should avoid doing, uh, which makes some sense, is having zoning along your main throughfares. Um, apparently, uh, you know, you don't have the traffic going in and out of driveways, it makes things a little more efficient on the road. 
I can't really say is that is illogical either. Uh, it does seem to make some sense. Um, I just had a train through here. I think. should do here is link that up like so and block things up like like this no no need to do that one okay I think the link up there would make more Ugh, I went too far. Uh, here. Like so. Don't really need the link up there. Okay. Now, I shall add a little bit more here. Okay. Now, admittedly, uh, I have uh, placed a little bit of a burden on uh, the crossings on this road. I think some offices over here might be sensible. Ah, I have created a traffic jam. going. Aha. I think yeah. Okay, I'm going to put no, that's the wrong one. I want to put it back to normal speed. And going to allow freehand curves here. Okay. If I put another road across there, that might help. give the uh, trash trucks another alternative uh, and I have a fair amount of traffic headed around for that ramp right okay well logically if I just
make a direct route to the ramp. Yeah, that's too much stuff, too close together. Right. Okay. If I just don't allow it through there, and uh, wait, what's this? Yeah, I'm going to have to move that. Okay. No. Put it over here. Now. If this comes off this way. Like so. That should remove no that's not going to work Right. Let's see if that helps. Well, I think it did. Okay. Yeah, I think that works. Yeah, that looks slightly better. So it's all about providing paths that don't have obstacles.
right. Ah, right. There's one more. I should put a connector in like so, but I probably want to do it like that. some dumb zoning over here. So let's remove it. Yeah, zoning doesn't make sense in that hole. Okay. not where I want the road. Where I want the road is actually right there. Right. And I want, here we go, pedestrian path along here. Right, okay. And along here. Right. need to make sure it covers. And here we go. Uh, right. make sure this rail line actually connects all the way. Yeah, it does. doing here is uh, increasing the density right by the train station. Wow. 
where presumably there's good transit connections. And since there is a metro station there, the connection should be good. Now, what have I got going on here demographically? No, there we go. Unemployment's down. Okay, so far so good. Now I'm going to do a tour around here and look for traffic jams. No, I don't see one there or there. No, not over there either. That's heavy traffic, but it's moving. Um, yeah, it's all heavy traffic, but it's moving. So let's see what the traffic overlay has to say. Generally, not bad. Okay. Presumably, I only need um, I need three lanes there might uh, three lanes there might also. Okay, well that's not going to make things worse anyway. I do wish there was a three and four lane one-way road, um, but there isn't, at least not at this stage of the game development. Um, right. So what we have here is we have a hill with office buildings on it and a train station in back of it. Now there isn't a lot of uh, visible operations at that train station. It'd be nice if it would tell you how much uh, traffic the particular train station had. Uh, eventually I want to loop that track all the way back around to here. Uh, but I can't do that until I can buy this space. So I'm clearly not going to do that just now. Um, let's see how the okay trash is getting iffy so what I'm gonna do is plant it an incinerator over here
that may in fact reduce the uh, traffic coming over to these incinerators some okay is a train. Okay, it is getting used. Good. Okay, so I'm going to go wander over to another corner. Well, first of all, electricity's good. Um, yeah, I'm good there. Okay. So what I'm going to do is add some development over here. build my grids again. So if you're wondering about this S thing that I'm doing, it's an efficient way to minimize clicking when uh, determining uh, exactly where the various grid points are. And I keep missing by one. Okay. And now that I've got grid points set. connection right there. That seems to work. Okay. And I'll come one more down. This is the tedious part, if you're going to build grids. Now, the reason I'm going with these square blocks here is to maximize the roads that can provide uh, relief for the various uh, traffic uh, situations. Um, okay.
road here. We Okay, well, just bite the bullet here. Okay, and one more road connection, and one more water connection. for some zoning. get too far here. A uh, park or three is probably a good idea. Uh, okay. And uh, education setup. Okay, let's see. A healthcare setup. Okay, that can go right there. And we'll put uh, one of those in. And the all important fire. And police. And now for something completely different, zoning. Okay, come on, link up. Okay, if those areas would just link up.
then I could get rid of that one cross point. Okay, come on. Oh sure, it always builds in the other place. There we go. Okay, fill in the hole left behind, and we're golden. to grow the population substantially, but nope, that's not what I wanted. I want a pathway. Right. Okay, by doing this, I essentially protect the road there against zoning, even when I widen it. I should have put the path here. Yeah. Oh, come on. Okay. Um, okay, so I'll put some commercial there. That seems a reasonable spot for it. One thing that would be nice to have in Skylines would be an upgrade zoning where you can go from uh, low density to high density residential or low density to high density commercial. That would be quite uh, useful uh, if you wanted to change your existing uh, structure. Um, demographically, how are things doing? Uh, unemployment's decent. Uh, okay. I'm going to take another look for uh, traffic jams. Uh, traffic jams would be worse now with the uh, mod I have in for not despawning if it takes too long, uh, which means traffic jams will be as bad as they should be, as opposed to um, only half as bad. But for the most part, things seem to be moving. Well, those are abandoned. So that's annoying. I don't have a lot a lot of uh, issues though to deal with. I don't have abandoned uh, um, lots all over the place. That's good. Um, excellent. I will need to bring transit into here, but uh, that'll wait for another part. Right. No. I keep pressing escape when I don't need to. Um, okay. So I'm not sure where this highway is going off to, but uh, it will go somewhere. Um, 
not sure exactly. I may end up bending it around along here. Anyway. Right. Uh, good. I didn't make a lot of headway on my uh, milestone here. Um, <laughs> but uh, that's not a problem. Uh, well, uh, I'm going to call that a part here. Okay, so that's the end of part 12. I'll see everyone back for part 13. Thanks for watching.